Hello, my name is Laura Love, and I'm here to talk to you about the Certified Angel Card Reading Course that I have that is on, that's starting on May 28th. It's a one-day course, and it's going to be absolutely amazing. Today, I want to talk to you about two things. Sometimes, some people are not sure about which card deck to use during a card reading. The other one I want to, to talk to you about is about cards that either have an extra card in it or a missing card. And this is also taught in the lesson. So I'm actually teaching you some things that are in this course already. So about choosing what card deck to use when someone comes to you for a reading there's three decks that I mentioned that you really want to get. And the, the three decks are, are the Life Purpose, the Healing Cards by Archangel Raphael, and you want to get the Romance deck. And these are decks by Doreen Virtue. So you want to make sure you have those three decks because most times the questions are about people's life purpose, their careers, not being happy in their jobs, what what to do, what to do next, the relationships, romantic relationships especially, and as well as health. Um, some people come, I'm an energy healer, so I often use the healing cards because of the health issues that people come to me for. The other thing I want to mention is that is to just to basically use your intuition. If you feel that the, a particular deck would be really helpful in the reading, then go ahead and use that one. Another thing that you can do is, if you have three or four decks, is just to take them out and ask the client what, what deck they feel drawn to and that can help you to also choose the right deck. The other thing I want to talk to you about is what if you get a card deck, you buy a card deck and it's got extra cards or it's got some missing cards. Radley Valentine talks about this and he feels that if there's an extra card, then that card is for him. So he keeps that card and I sort of tend to go that way too. If I buy a deck and it's got an extra card, two of the same card, I like to keep that card and I say, this card is for me. But by all means, you can keep that card in the deck and still use the deck as, as is. The other thing is if there's a card that's missing, I truly feel that if the, the card deck is incomplete, if you have a card that's missing, so what you can do if you buy your if you're buying your card decks by from hayhouse.com all you need to do is write to them and let them know that you're missing a card and they will send it to you and i believe it's the same thing with amazon or ebay you could probably get the missing card as well so this is my teaching today i'm trying to keep them short because I just feel like people don't want to listen to long drawn out uh, videos. I know I don't really care to. So I'm keeping them short. And the next video, I'm having an upcoming video where I'm actually doing a card reading for someone who has an actual issue she wants to talk about and get some clarification and validation in her life. So look out for that one because that one is going to be coming out really soon. Thank you and have a great day and I hope to see you on May 28th.